Well, parents will tell you, you know, it's really hard to watch your children when they leave home and find their place in the world. That's right. Of course, we want to send them off with the proper guidance and something memorable like our recipes, right? So, our right, Mike Jerrica, in today's You Gotta Try, this talks to one local mom who does just that. I have come to Cherry Hill, New Jersey on Starling Lane, a charming block to meet this charming woman right here. This is Holly, Holly Friedman. Look at the book she has written. Home cooking is good for you. So she raised three sons in this house. I did. And so now they're off and they miss their mommy. They I do. Too. And they miss your <laughs> cooking, right? Absolutely. So what's the concept of the book? Concept is easy, simple recipes to teach them how to cook. I need home, home cooking. Learning how to put everything together, taste good, look good, and make it simple cleanup. So it's simple, but delicious. delicious. Okay, so uh, I'm gonna sample some of the food that your sons could have made. Absolutely. Okay, let's start with it. What in the heck are these? These are lasagnas that are made with wonton skins. Oh, look at that, that's a wonton. So you don't even have to cook lasagna noodles. Oh, that's good. I've never had that before in my life. Okay. You invent that? Uh, I improvised. Oh, hold on. Let's hear. Salmon teriyaki with honey mustard. The salmon, honey mustard, and teriyaki sauce. Oh my goodness. Buffalo chicken dip. Chicken, cream cheese, and hot sauce. Great for Super Bowl. What kind party. of hot sauce do you use? Frank's. Frank's, that's what I love. Love Frank's. Of course. You can make it hot or not so hot. Now, meatballs. Every guy likes meatballs. Yep. Are these, how are these different? Well, they're pre-made meatballs, so you don't even have to make the meatballs. What do you and, mean pre-made? You buy them at the grocery store? Yeah, and they're turkey meatballs, so they're actually healthy. Um, and I use chili sauce, cranberry sauce, and my secret ingredient of ginger snacks. There's no way guys in their 20s can make brownies that look like that. Absolutely. Really? From the book? Absolutely. It's called Brookie. Oh, it's a Brookie? It's Brookie because it's brownie with chocolate chip cookie on top. And it's a mix. You use brownie mix and chocolate chip cookie dough that's already made on top. That's a cookie mm -hmm. on top? Yep. That Very is. Very yummy. That is stunning. Mm -hmm. Stunning. So your kids, your sons played a lot of baseball, huh? Baseball, basketball, anything with a ball. So I like the idea from a baseball mitt to an oven mitt. Yes. And you know what the best thing about it, Mike? Yeah. Is they call me and talk to me about it. Oh, <laughs> so that's why you wrote this. <laughs> exactly. You just stay, want, want to stay close to your son. Exactly. I love these, by the way. Yeah. Holly, thank you. Thank you. You got to try this. That is so cute. That's always the truth. You call your parents for a recipe. Mom, how do I, you know, what do I set the oven to? That's a great idea. If you want to send Mike a great idea from your kitchen, a dish he's got to try, a great new restaurant, just come to our website, myfoxphilly.com, and scroll down to the, you got to try this. By the way, that book's on Amazon.com. That book is on Amazon.com, says did, our Mike Jarek. Those things look so good, didn't they? It does mm. look so good, and it's so great for guys. I love it, girls, anybody. All right, so so many of us complain that